You think so? But you said he was up in one of the islands. I thought he was, but must have been that one. Just hold on guys, we've, we've got a visual of him, he's just currently in a shop at the minute, we're just going to grab him when he comes out. Is that his mum? We're directly across from his house and his mum is currently watching out the window. <coughs> Craig! Your name Craig? Oh, eh? No, is your name Craig? No. What's your name? James. James? Ah. Uh, Craig James? No. Just James. Right. Can we just show you this for a second please? Oh uh -huh. I've been speaking to a 13 year old girl. You're meant well, to meet her tonight. Well, she told me she was 18. No, she no, didn't. So we've got the, the you're 25, is that correct? Uh -huh. uh, you're 12 years older than her. It was you that actually says you were 12 years older than her. Uh -huh. We have the chat, all the chats here. You're supposed to be meeting her. Mm -hmm. her no. That's no. But, um, is that wrong then? Ah, uh, it's wrong. Have you sent her pictures of your penis? No, it's not my penis. But you've, okay, so you sent her pictures of a penis. Oh. Okay, so we've got here. Do you want to move up there? Yeah, do you want to move up out of the way? <clears throat> so you were supposed to meet this girl yesterday, I believe it was. Um, but she wasn't able to make it. So here you press it, Anne. You're okay with me being 12 years older than you. And you're 25, and you knew that would make her 13. And you said you're fine when we started so talking. She told me that she was 18 because I got her on. Uh, you ever heard a site called Tag? Mm -hmm. Well, she was on there, and that's an 18 plus site. It is an 18 plus site, yeah. It is, you're correct. But she did tell you from the beginning that she was 13. But then the first three messages, she's told you that she was 13 years old. Right, yeah, I'm sorry about that. What would you have done if this girl came here? Were you going to say sorry to her? I wouldn't have done anything with her. Well, that's not what the paperwork says. Yeah, you've told That's not what your words are saying. I mean, your intentions are clear in that. You've said to her um, that, obviously, because she's 13 and you have a big cock, um, will you, do, does she want to have sex with you when you meet up? Uh, that I was joking about because I knew nothing would ever happen. Well, you said you want to be with her and you want to... Hold on, just let the person go first. Um, well, you fair enough, I kind of was wrong, me messaging her. But nothing was ever going to happen between us. But that's not what you've stated here. You've made in your intention... Well, fair, so, fair enough, I get it was wrong. Your, your intention tonight... My intention wasn't to do anything with her, I promise you I wasn't going to. Well, even, though, even though according to the messages, I, but I wasn't going to do anything with her. But, so why would you come and meet her then? I wasn't actually going to meet her. But you've been sitting at your window. Waiting for her to go waiting to that for shop. Because she did say she was going into that shop and you've now approached. Well, I went out of the shop for her to get tobacco. So hmm. that's why I was locking. So you, you've... you've 
told a 13 year old that you're going to meet her here tonight that 13 year old being travelling from England to come and meet you and you weren't in going to intend to meet her no so you were just going to leave a 13 year old thanks very much <coughs> on the street well she was the one that made the plans you sure about that Aye. Are you 100% certain about that? Because we've got. Look, at the end of the day, I wouldn't. We've got five. We've got, five, be honest we've got 500 pages. Well, I'm not being honest, honest we've got 556 pages, I believe it is, of chat from you and this girl. Right, I did. I, I was so right. we've got we've got every single bit <coughs> from you've the first message. That when you meet, for her to say, you'll tell folk that um, she's your cousin, so it doesn't make it look. Suspicious. I was asking numerous amounts of times um, if she's got thongs on. Um, guess you would rather be with me than at school. You want to kiss and cuddle. Asking if she's naked in bed. Um, are you going to get naughty for me when when you're at home? Yeah. I'm sorry, I can't it's wrong. So you, but, um, are you agreeing with everything we're saying? You've 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 come here to meet a thirteen year old girl to take her to the woods to have sex with her. Well, this is Craig James Douglas twenty five from Kilmarnock. Oh, okay. It's Craig James. Craig James, okay. So you 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 know what you've done wrong He has facilitated a meet with a thirteen year old. The police will be called. You will be arrested for grooming an underage um, a child under the age of 16. Can I do this for you, sir? Yeah. Do you want me to take that? Yeah. Uh, yeah, no, I'll take that. Yeah, it's okay. Um, you've also said, to her, is it a time of month? Because you don't want her fingers to get bloody. Wait, well, it doesn't matter what's wrong, but just get off it. She was the one that says that she was 18, so... She actually says to you, personally, that she's 18. Come on, be honest. Well, yeah, I'm sorry. She I'm... told you, she was on a... Although it may have been a site where it says you have to be 18. She didn't actually tell you she was and 18. By the way, just to let you know... I was in the meeting here, I do stay here. I know you stay here because you've told her you stay, you've told her your address. Mate, I'm sorry about that. I can't, I'm, I can't much more than that, but anyway, I'm going to get arrested and all that. I'm not going to end up in court. Right, so, you Have you been speaking to any other children online? Any no. under, under the age of 16? No. Other ones I've spoken to is like 21, 20, and that. Are you sure about that? Because it... Oh, yeah, I'm not sure. Looking, I'm not trying to get back with my ex. So, why are you speaking to this child then? I don't know. She was the one that keeps talking to me too, so... Well, from what I've seen, when she doesn't talk to you, you're, you're constant asking her, you know, know, are you not talking to me now? Why are you not talking to me? You know, do you want me to leave you alone? Every time she's not talking, so I wouldn't say that she was the one that was pestering you. I think it's you that's done wrong here. Uh -huh. the, the girl did not tell you personally that she was 18. She has told you she is 13. But, what I think I've done wrong. But why did she set yeah. up an 18? But that's irrelevant. That is irrelevant. As soon as someone tells you the that they are 13, what should you have done? Stop talking to her. Stop her. talking to her or reported her or you know, got her off that site I know, I'm, for, I'm, in case people spoke to her. I do, I do know, I do know that is wrong. But I'm not that sort of person. Well, you, you, you can't say that, can you? Because I know, I can't it's know. proved here that, and she's definitely, you know, you know the age of consent, yeah? Aye. What's, 18. It's actually 16, but that's even worse if you think that. Take it, that's your mum that was looking out the window. Mm -hmm. What's your mum going to think? I don't know. 
Did your mum know you were speaking to people online? She knows I speak to people online. Okay, brilliant. Thank you very much, thank you. But she wasn't aware it was a... That's a... Child. Least underwear. Um, why? Why would you do it? I know what was wrong, because, look, fair enough, I was an 18 site, and what's a 13 year old claiming that she's 18? But she didn't claim yeah. to you she was 18. Well, her profile does, and the whole point of the site is right. to Right, yeah, that, that's okay, but, but as soon as you've said hi to that person and they've told you their age is 13, I know, I should have just stopped talking. Then, that, so. there and then, you know, there and then, that, that, that she's, not, she's not 18. <laughs> You're still in your college course? Mm -hmm. You might have to say goodbye to that. I was going to anyway because of the health problems. How old's your sister if you don't mind me asking? She's two years younger than me. Right. No, that's just... So she's over the age of 16. Uh, Why didn't you go to a pub? Mm -hmm. Find a girl at a pub. I can't, I can't drink because of my health problems. Okay, so do you have any mental health problems? I don't know that I'm aware of. What is your health problem? What is your health condition? I've got stomach ulcers that are that close to bursting. I've got uh, a hernia and all that. Is there anything that you need medication for right now? Aye. What is it? I what? don't take uh, medication with all my clothes on and all that. Do you need it right at this minute? Not at this minute, no. Guys, please! This is this is How what. Is Please, honestly. Do you want to go and stand over there? Can I just go over there with us sooner, please? Can't wait. Well, the police will be coming to get you, so. Oh, I will. I need to go and explain to my mother. <laughs> if you don't mind. Neil, he wants to go in and explain to his mum. I'm not going to do a runner if that's what you're thinking. Where's your phone? I don't know your phone, it's lying this in the bar. Alright, uh, what have you been using to speak to everybody? My laptop, but my laptop. What? My laptop's got eyes on it now. Right, um, the only thing is, if we let you into your property, I mean, you can go over your property and I can knock on the door and ask your mum to come out if you want. Yeah, but you, we, we maybe you better go in your garden anyway because there's a lot of people... Yeah, well, you just leave your door open a bit then. Yeah, it's running a bit. But unless, you're going to, unless you've got to try to the door, we can't really let you into the property. We don't know what you've got to do. Not again, I'm not getting any numbers. We've had to come into the guy's garden as um, there's be a few people round about the area shouting the odds. You're no class my boy that. I'm no what? No class my boy when 
I'm not classing your boy anything. I'm here because he's been speaking to a 13 year old boy. Well, he didn't again. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. He's admitted it. There you go. He did. He knew exactly what he was doing. Aye, but 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 what was that? What was he saying? That he wanted to her. To meet her at that shop there so he could the take her in the woods and have sex with her. The convert, he was taking her in the woods tonight to have sex with her. He doesn't get it, mate, he's listening well, to the Xbox. Right, well, listen, that's what he says. Listen, I'm sorry, there's no point in shouting at me. I'm here because of what we've been given and what we've been shown. Excuse me, go and phone the police. The police are on their way. They're on their way. Are they? Yeah, they're on their way. Good. Why else there? Why else there? I know I've done that. That's what this guy's standing out here for. Because that people are allowed to go to the shop. It's nothing to do with us. Like we're not from here. Away from them. Legally not allowed to enter your property. Facts and the evidence is put in front of people. I mean, this has got to destroy her. What for? I'd respect you for being honest. You know, I mean, at least you, you were able to tell your mum there. No, you have to go every way. Yes, we do. No, you don't. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. Because I can assure you, he has no that. Does he know? No what? Nice, no. No what? We're, we've not accused him of being anything. We've handed evidence in front of him, and he has, uh, he said that he has done this. Do so whatever that is that you're referring to. You might get the fucking my lord. to meet her over at the shops here and he was going to take her into some woods about here somewhere. <laughs> That's just what he was, we're not from here obviously so we don't know this area but he says he was going to take her into the woods for sexual intercourse. Um, 
just currently waiting for the police. Um, what can I say? Obviously, Mum's not going to be very happy. That's understandable. Yeah. He's uh, yeah, he is. He's he's quite. You know, he's opened. He told his mum what what he's done. He's admitted it. I think his mum's went from being angry to a bit gutted. What's happened here? Realizations kicked in. Now you just push it. Oh. Realizations kicked in to anything. Yeah, definitely. He's been sitting at his window for the best part of what half an hour. Yeah. Waiting for a, this thirteen-year-old to turn up at the shop directly across from his property. He's obviously not seen her, so he's gone himself over to the shop to see if she was in the shop. There's the police. I'll just walk away for a minute, let him deal with the police. Yeah, please, if you know where the, uh, where we are, please stay away. It's not the family's fault. As you can probably tell, his mum wasn't aware of any of this. Certainly not her fault. He's admitted everything. He's been speaking to this decoy for a long time. He's sent indecent images. He has continuously asking her if she's got thongs on because it makes him horny. Um, he was meeting her to take her into the woods, asking for pictures of her, trying to get her to. Um, Uh, sorry, um, touch her vagina, telling her where to touch. Knew, he'd said on a few occasions that he knew he was 12 years older than her, and he didn't mind that at all, he wasn't bothered about the age. <laughs> what? Keep driving, I'm going to get for the of the beast. Who were you shouting at? Who was shouting down the radio? Eh? Who was shouting down the radio? He's getting the supervisor and I said, don't want a supervisor, I want a sergeant. Oh, so you got threatened with a breach of the peace? No, I got threatened with a breach of the peace. Oh, well, just... Why are you getting threatened with that? Because you've brought them out to something like this? All oh, right, okay. Okay, so Neil has just been threatened with breach of the peace because he said he, he didn't want a supervisor down, he wanted a sergeant down. Sorry, can't give you, make any sense of that, but that's just what he's been told. There was a lot of congregation there, a lot of people turned up.
kind of had to get him out of the way into his garden because... Sorry? Okay. For you or for him? For me. Probably. He's requested the sergeant. He's not speaking to me like a piece of shit. Been after this guy for weeks and weeks and weeks. Well, suspected. Yeah, suspected. Was it really? Was it? There was rumours about that. <laughs> it's amazing what you could uncover there. Eh? Um, his mum had said, um, when are you going to learn? I don't know if that's... Is that the show? Sorry? Is that the show? Who? No, they're in the house. one going away. Police are in the property. Um, obviously, I don't think for a minute that you'll deny it, but. Oh, it's freezing. Thank you. It's a, an area where everybody is coming out in force all the weekends. about my car keys. Hiya. One of the officers is not very keen. Not very keen on what we're doing. Ah? You're free already. You didn't even get taken in the van.
yeah, we are, um, I don't know if I'm able to see it. Okay, so this is Craig James, 25, been speaking to a 13 year old decoy for weeks now, has arranged a meet, um, meet today, meet tonight, to take her into the woods for sex. So, we've obviously been here and met him instead. Oh, there's the big van coming. Yet. He's still in the property. I think that's the sergeant just arrived. We're in Kilmarnock. Okay, I'm going to cut the speed just now because it's just having everybody looking at the floor down even when nothing really to tell you but I'll come back on when they bring them out. Thanks guys. <laughs> 